Uncover the intriguing life of Elizabeth Moss in this exclusive video. Explore her comprehensive biography, revealing her age, height, and weight, and delve into her surprising journey as a fashion model. From her early acting days to her current status as a Hollywood powerhouse, discover the milestones that have shaped her remarkable career. Get an insider's look at her personal life, fashion evolution, and the secrets behind her success. Don't miss this in-depth exploration of Elizabeth Moss's fascinating story. Elizabeth Moss is an American actor and producer. She is known for her work in several television dramas, garnering many accolades, including two Primetime Emmy Awards and two Golden Globe Awards, which led Vulture to name her the Queen of Peak TV. Born, July 24, 1982, age 41 years, Los Angeles, California, United States. Spouse, Fred Armisen, M., 2009-2011. Parents, Ron Moss, Linda Moss. Siblings, Derek Moss. Awards, Full List. Citizenship, United States, United Kingdom. Elizabeth Moss net worth $30 million. Early Life Moss was born in Los Angeles, California, the daughter of Ronald Charles Moss, who was British and originally from Birmingham, England, and Linda Moss, née Ekstrom, an American of part Swedish descent. Both of Moss's parents were musicians, her mother plays jazz and blues harmonica professionally. Moss has one younger brother. She was raised a Scientologist. Initially, Moss aspired to be a professional dancer. In her adolescence, she traveled to New York City to study ballet at the School of American Ballet, after which she studied with Suzanne Farrell at the Kennedy Center in Washington, D.C. She continued to study dance through her teenage years, but started getting acting roles as well. To manage her education and career, she began homeschooling and graduated in 1999. Career 1990-2006, Early Work and the West Wing Moss's first screen role was in 1990, when she appeared in the NBC miniseries Lucky Slash Chances. From 1992 until 1995, she appeared as Cynthia Parks in seven episodes of the TV series Picket Fences. She provided the voice of Holly DiCarlo, a main character in the TV special Frosty Returns, 1992, and of Michelle in the animated film Once Upon a Forest, 1993. She appeared in the television remake of the 1993 film Gypsy and played Harvey Keitel's younger daughter in the film Imaginary Crimes, 1994. The following year, she appeared in the remake of the Walt Disney Pictures film Escape to Witch Mountain, 1995, and played a young Ashley Judd in the biopic Love Can Build a Bridge, 1995. She also had a supporting role in the drama Separate Lives, 1995, opposite Jim Belushi and Linda Hamilton, and a minor part in the black comedy The Last Supper, 1995. She did more voice work for the animated series Freakazoid and the television film It's Spring Training, Charlie Brown, 1996. Beginning in 1999, Moss played the recurring role of Zoe Bartlett in the White House television drama The West Wing, playing the daughter of President Josiah Bartlett, Martin Sheen, and First Lady Abby Bartlett, Stockard Channing, she portrayed the character until the series finale in 2006. Her character became integral to the fourth season of the show, in a retrospective on the series The Atlantic noted, Aaron Sorkin made the centerpiece of the explosive fourth season finale where he basically engineered the most insane cliffhanger possible. It required Zoe to be a bit of a pain with her fancy French boyfriend, but Moss always made her relatable, even when the plot required otherwise. Moss posing on the red carpet. In 1999, she had a supporting role as a patient in a mental institution in James Manbold's psychological drama Girl, Interrupted, opposite Winona Ryder and Angelina Jolie, and a minor part in the drama Anywhere But Here. The same year, she had a small role in the film Mumford, 1999 playing the daughter of a woman with a shopping addiction. In 2002, Moss appeared in a commercial for Excedrin in which she directly addressed the audience about the medication's benefits for people who suffer from migraines. The spot proved enduringly popular and ran for several years, providing Moss with residual income as she struggled to make it as an actor. Moss appeared in Heart of America and three other films in 2004. That year, she made the film Virgin for which she was nominated for an Independent Spirit Award. Moss also had a supporting part in Ron Howard's Western thriller The Missing, 
2003. Moss had a supporting role in the 2005-2006 horror series Invasion, and appeared in television again on a 2007 episode of Grey's Anatomy entitled My Favorite Mistake, and on the series Medium opposite Patricia Arquette. She also appeared in Mary Lambert's 2007 horror film The Attic, the independent drama Day Zero, 2007, and the 2008 drama El Camino.